Good evening and welcome to Gray Barn Antiques of Andover, New Jersey. We specialize but are not limited to antiques, collectibles, and contemporary finds. Tonight we're going to visit with our vendor, Good To Go, who you will see on his tags are indicated by Nick. He is a 20% off vendor on items not marked fur. Nick has recently moved to the stage at Gray Barn and he also has a shelf in the case room. He also previously had a bookcase in there, but now that he's got more space, he just has everything up on that stage. So without further ado, we're gonna go through how to reach us. If you see anything in this video or any of our past videos, which you need more information on or wish to purchase, we gladly do ship those smaller items. You can find us on Facebook at Gray Barn Antiques, Instagram, Gray Period Barn, Gray always with the E, and you can direct message us there. Please be sure to subscribe to this channel that you are watching us on YouTube, Gray Barn Antiques, to be alerted to new content. We also do a weekly Facebook Live, Wednesday nights usually. Sometimes we do a pop-up one. So if you are on Facebook and you wish to follow us on there and like us, make sure you set it so that it alerts you when new items do arrive. Uh, when we do a new Facebook Live pop-up, like I said, we do some random ones from time to time. Right now I'm kind of stuck on... This is our vendor, Betty's Treasures. If you do follow us on Facebook and Instagram, you will see that over the last yesterday and today, I only got to do one uh, grouping of pictures. I've started doing like little compilations of each booth, and I do a bunch of pictures from their booths. There's no information on it, but what you can do is, again, you can just reach out to us, and we will gladly get you those prices on those items. And we do ship from zip code 07821. We do use actual shipping from USPS.com, so you can get an idea of what it would cost to ship to you. We do not charge a handling or packaging fee. We do accept payment via PayPal, which is how you'll get your invoice, or feel free to call us. Yeah, I thought that little six was, that one was covered there. Feel free to call us and pay over the phone with your credit card securely. We do not write down your information. It goes into our credit card machine to the bank, and we never see it again. And it is the same price for cash or credit. So this is his shelf in the case. And again, he is 20% off for cash or credit card. We take Visa, MasterCard, and Discover. And the price will be off the lowest price as long as it does not say that word firm. So for an example, this knife was recently marked down from $16 to $10. So it would be 20% off that 10, thus becoming $8. That weird little lighting reflection there is from the we have black lights. We have quite a few black lights in the shop, so, because we have a lot of uranium glass, which is kind of fun. Really cool little cigarette picker up there back there. I can't quite see the tag. That's just, wow, $12, because he does have some condition issues, but he still is very cool looking. It is old. That's just $9.60. They kind of try to let the tags do the talking. Now, You've seen in some of our past videos, we do have vendors that like to put the size on everything, which helps. So if you need measurements on any of these items, I'll gladly get you those if that information. So 55 becomes 44. And I'm going to see if I can slide this over the side. This door can be a touch stubborn on this side. But it's been working well the last couple of days. Oh, beautiful vintage beaded purse. Look at that beadwork on that and the clasp and everything on that. It's just beautiful. And he does have quite a bit of jewelry. And again, you're taking that 20% off. If it doesn't say firm, you might have to bend a little bit to see down here. He's got jewelry in here as well. Costume jewelry, silver jewelry. This little bracelet's just $6.40, little stretch bracelet. This is interesting. Dragon Onyx Marble Necklace is just 16. Where's the back? Ooh, that's nice. That's very nice. Let's get that off the face there so you can actually see it. A lot of cool metals, charms, bracelets. And again, you are going to take that 20% off. Now, I'm not going to try to move the camera too fast because I know how jostling that can be. You can see 
There are multiple vendors within this case, as within the whole shop. So if you do see anything as I'm strolling back to the stage area of Grey Barn that you wish to get more information on or you wish to purchase, just let us know. I did start turning off some of the lights. We did visit with Auntie's Attic last week. And you'll see like on Second Thought and Bronx Man Cave, we actually did do and Vintage Crush today. I did the spreads on them on Instagram on, and Facebook. Redreamable, Booth One. She's got this beautiful wall of art. And this was, we featured Burning Sensation a few weeks ago. And I cannot believe that this shadow box with the veil is still here. I don't know if that would be shippable. There'd be probably a fee on it, but it is shippable. It just might cost a little bit. So this is the stage. We have three pretty good sized stairs to get up there. Well lit. Railing so you can help yourself up if you have problems with your legs. It's not too bad of a climb. So he's got this whole stage, which is currently the largest booth in our shop. And we're going to work on getting lighting in that corner so we can see better over there and plug in all those lights. These lights are all working lights that you see hanging. And again, you're going to take that 20% off. Beautiful tiger oak dresser back there. Check this out. Now, if you look online and check if you have worth point or anything, I mean, it does have condition issues. It came off of a a building. It's just $60 for this antique cupola with copper roof. So the copper has turned to green as copper is wanting to do over the course of years. So it is in chippy, true vintage fine condition. In better condition, these go for well over $150 and higher. That's a neat little coat stand there. Look at that. Coat and umbrella rack. That's very nice. I like that. That's a good deal. And screws for compact storage $60 so yep see that goes through and then you can put your umbrellas and everything that's really convenient I don't know if there's a lining on it but no but, and look how pretty that is and that's just $60 that's a nice little piece of furniture right there and you've got to look everywhere there are things everywhere they allocate the floor they allocate the walls the ceilings and that's why I love my selfie stick because I can actually show you the items up high without too many issues. Now this is the scale tray that you would use for hanging scales, just $28. So if you're looking to make a nice hanging scale and you ha if you can find just the components, you can probably build one for cheaper than if you bought the whole thing all together. So always keep that in mind when you see components. Can you get the rest of it? That you can actually just get a regular, I don't see it in here, but a lot of times you can find those, oh wait, no, is that, no. Oh, my glasses on. I thought I found one. But if I come across one, I'll show you what I mean about what you would use to hang on there. Look at all this great old lab equipment. Again, you're taking that 20% off of that red price. So 14 becomes 1120. A lot of Pyrex and just really cool. This is cute. And that's just $4. Is that signed? Nice stoneware picture. Oh, yeah, it is. Let me get you to focus. That's a nice little piece there, and that's just four dollars. It's very cute. If you like Coca Cola, twelve dollars for the canister. A very cool heating lamp back here. I don't know if it's for animal or vegetable or what it's. Oh, photography heat lamp. So twenty nine dollars, and then take that twenty percent off. These are really cute. There's just two left. We have more of these. Nine sixty. They're little slide holders, but you can use them for your different business cards, you know, maybe put them sideways or any other kind of storage. I just love old lab equipment or any kind of things like this for extra storage. This, I'm surprised, is still here. This is the little the little paper rack and it has the tear and it's really fishy, fishy. It's only $9.60 and this is really adorable. It's in really good shape. What am I hitting here? Oh, there's glass there. I thought it was open. That'd be why it's not moving. This is $9.60. It's a nice mustache cup. He marked that down half price to just four eighty. A little vintage dice. There's a little bag of vintage tins for twelve. Fishy. How much are you fishy? Fishy wishy. Carved wood fish for twenty five sixty. Very cool. And again, if you need more information, better you know, let me know. I'll send you better pictures. I'll get you whatever information you need and we will gladly ship any of these items. That's interesting. It just came in. It's got so much stuff here. Okay. 
that is just $17.60 for the horse and chariot toy. That's very colorful. This is like wood with paper. Box of vintage ornaments for $19.20. Stone boxes, $28 and $16, and then 20% off. This is cute. A little toy typewriter. Simply special demonstrated, and that's 20% off, so that becomes 52 and it has the original box, which way back in the day it sold for $3, which was probably a lot of money back then. Nice scales, he's got plushies. Buttons is still here. Buttons does work for the most part. I think what it doesn't work on him. Where's his tag? There it is. Uh, buttons no longer speaks. He's been reduced from 85 to 69, and then take that 20% off. We get the tail wag when we press. Paw. Right eye. Right. Ears up. That works. Woo! Tit left eye. Bark is what we don't get. We don't get a bark. His mouth doesn't move. Head turns left. Head turns right. And he does have some spotting issues and such, but his fur is still on there. The, the lit, though, on the tin is fantastic. I don't have the box, but you see, he's, you know, he's been played with over the years, and he does have some age, so that's quite a nice little deal there. And he's sitting on top of this really cute little Ginny doll case, 33 and then 20% off of that. I remember those stuffed animals. They were hard as rocks, but... We still love them. Now this clock, I cannot believe is still here. It's just $52 for the working grandmother clock. And I said before, I mean, if you don't like it the way it is, these were selling a couple years ago for well over $200 and either painted or not painted. A lot of people were just dressing them with the cream colored paint. This is an interesting corner type light what we got here. Again, reduced 1970s corner slag glass lamp and these beautiful autumn colors and that is 20% off. We always have a beautiful selection of original oils in here with this beautiful gold gilt frame. Look at that price. So it'll be like 47 something and that is signed. So just to give you, isn't that beautiful? Lovely colors. Give me an R and E. So, those are the R and the E are 1440 and the ampersand is 1760. Not super old, just really cool. Oh, this is cute. 960 for your vintage little kitchen. A little pot holder hanger. A little old key there for 1440. Now this bell does have a crack. So it doesn't really sound great. It looks kind of cool. It's just $12. Trivets and sad iron rests, all kinds of things. I know people have bought these kind of things and they make them into lamps or other things to hang off of in their kitchen. They'll use it for pot hangers and stuff. And there's that beautiful dresser with the mirror. And the measurements are right on top there. And these were recently marked it down further to 295. Beautiful details on this. And the mirror, this beveled mirror, I'm actually not seeing any black usually there's like blackening in it from the back because like the silver that gives you the reflection starts to wear off that one's actually in pretty good shape now the belt is missing these 24 dollars it does work but it's it's missing the little piece that would have been here for you to go bam so do not go bam or you're going to impale yourself on a tur this piece here you don't want to impale yourself and this one's not really working very well Something needs to be tightened up there. It's got these really cool lead figures. What's this? This is a little cast iron house bank. It's a little cabin. And that would have had screws or something on it to hold it together. It's got a lot of brass pieces. So 55 becomes 44. This is a very interesting little figure. Bronze ram casting. It has some very Chinese kind of thing. Ooh, that thing. That's got some serious weight to it. Nice piece of glassware for $14.40. That's a bottle. That's one of those ones that they used to stretch. So if you watched my Facebook Live last night or you watched the replay, you would have seen a couple of these items popped up on there. A 
piggy unfortunately does have some damage issues little dollhouse wheel uh spinning wheels is 320. like i said they make the best the use of every inch our vendors of their space this is a pair of what are these so 1280 for those very unusual they're like um almost like that hard paper mache there they would i can't quite i guess they're no, I think they're like that hard paper mache. They feel like wood on the other side. Oh, this is cute. Look at this little interesting thing here that somebody, physics lab ruler apparatus, and that's just 24. Oh, here's what I was talking about for those hangings. So this, you'd use this, and that's just $8. And then you get that tray, and you have yourself the hanging scale at a fraction of a price. I mean, down the road, if you want, you can probably find the uh, large-faced ones. But for to start, eight. And what did we say was on that? I don't want to run along here too fast. Eight and then 28. So for $36, you can make yourself a beautiful hanging scale, which go for a lot more when they're complete. So 75 becomes 60 for that mirror. Like I said, the lighting does work. It's just not all lit up. It has some really cool tapestries and such up there on the ladder. This is a large Last Supper tapestry, 49 and then 20% off. And that is $36. This light becomes $52. That's a pretty hanging lamp right there. Let's get on to the other side of that. $125, so that becomes $100. It does have all the chains with it. 1950s pendant lamp. This is a vanity mirror. The, it does have that stain that would do this like crackling it's just the lacquer the stain that does that finish so that becomes 44 but you can see that's a really nice three-way mirror what does the other side look like just the, the wood there's a cool picture frame back there a lot of halloween decor i don't want to skip over anything these are nice little metal drawers these are always good to have that one's 28 the double one is 39 and then 20 percent off there's a lot of cast iron pieces unusual a bamboo bowl coil reed basket for 12 uh, it feels like it's very interesting it's just $12 very cool shoe stretchers all kinds of things $8 for the Ray Dunn chow down jar and that does have its good suction on it little tea set for just six forty. piece of coral is that yep coral for 20 And if I've gone too fast, I pass something, I will gladly come back and get that for you. Now, I would do lives from back here, but unfortunately, our reception in our building is not always the greatest, so I would be losing you left and right. So, we just do these assorted silver-plated cutlery for just $6.40. And I think, looks like the jar's included, so that is a good deal right there. If you do crafts with this kind of stuff, a lot of people like to use these. They, they put, like, different... Uh, spice names in their garden and use those as garden markers on the plates now this hen has some issues he has to crack back in base so he's just 320 because of that because he has a significant crack the pair of candy glass containers is just 960 for the two of them now these would have had uh like little it's almost like a sprinkle kind of thing in there they're the candies they're a little like round pellet colored balls little things of sugar and it would have the paper cover over here and you have all different types of these candy glass candy containers the dogs were the most popular and the most prevalent um don actually has a collection of these he has plenty of the clear but i found him carnival glass and amber glass and i've also started him on of course i had to get him a locomotive one since that is his job so can't let him not ever feel like he's working 24 7. $20 for the safety sign. Oh, that's on there. That's not stickers, right? You know, those aren't stickers on there. So that's a nice, heavy. It's got some uh, good weight to it. That's a good deal. That's just $20 for that sign. And it, like I said, it does have a little weight to it. Feels about two and a half, three pounds on that. His bells, it's got very sad bells. I will say that. <laughs> Keep coming up, trying to get a nice sonorous sound, and I'm getting nothing. So that's pretty cool. That's just, as you can see, that's a big reduction. He marked that down $50 to $75. We're going to take that 20% off, and that becomes just $60 for 
for the 1930s, so this is almost 100 years old, Helmut's coil physics lab equipment. So you can see he robbed a lab of all this great stuff. <laughs> Very cool. Let's see how much is this little bag back here. I know a lot of people love to use these little army bags. And there's the tag. We're going to get it without pulling it off the wall, I hope. Let's see. Wow, that's been reduced down to 14, so it's just 11.20. It's a mask bag, so that's pretty cool. A lot of people use these just to, because they're kind of cool, just for extra storage and stuff. Maybe what's this? What are you? Some kind of animal box, cricket box. Primitive late 1800s punch steel wood foot warmer. A foot warmer, and that's $48. That's very unusual. Oh yeah, there you go. You put your little, I guess, coals inside of there. So it's all tin and it's in this little wood crate. A little handcrafted little piece there. That's got some nice age to it. Beautiful veneer on that. It's like peg in there and it's not nails. Very interesting. And these drawers, he's finally marked these down. 29 and then we have the 20% off on those. Poor dead rabbit down here. He is 960. I remember having these, they come out, we take them out at Easter time. Here's an erector set from the 1920s with the wood box, brass handles, $95. And I can't really do this with one hand to see what's in there. This looks heavy, so we're not gonna pick those up. Four lab weights for $20, so you got a pile here, and there's a second pile here, and this pile is three of them for $16. He's got some great old wood toys down here. Well, it's just $6.40 for this guy. What does he do? What is that? Okay, okay a little train that goes with that. That hooks up together. There's a nice crate down here, blue anchor. That's just $17.60. Is that what I'm seeing? No, this is, what the heck is that? Wash bowl. Yeah, that's not a wash bowl. So I don't know. That's, that looks like that's incorrectly taxed. So we can get that correct information for you while we issue him a demerit for that. Um, <laughs> demerits are our running gag. When our vendors do things wrong, they get demerits, and we have the demerit queen. So these are nice little levels. Looks like they work pretty well. They're just fun to display. You always have room for more smalls like this. And what a fun collectible that would be. And here we go with some more vintage lab equipment. Lucite amp meter. So that's back. This is all one piece thing here. I don't know what the front of this looks interesting. It's got a protractor hooked on there and Lucite base on it. I don't know if that works. And here's more animals for you. And like I said, these do light, these do light up. We just have to get them all set up. And this one is, this is plastic chandelier with standard plug for 44. Oh, that's very lightweight. Philadelphia Eagles fans, we got your frame here for your license for just $14.40. Some nice old street signs for $14.40. A brass spring coil for $8. It looks like a very sad broken slinky. Here's just sad hanging here. And let's see, this is nice. Some really cool little component bits floating around in here too. $14.40 on the tape measure. And what are these? These are neat. They're like little lucite panels. And they're $12 each. They're knife switch, whatever that is. Lots of little gauges. And let's see. Card symbol, old Japan, 320. So, okay, so there's a bag of, of doll heads and parts and bits with the stand. And then there's some molds and stuff in there. Cookie cutters. We have a Cobalt George Washington. I had him up last week on my Facebook Live. These are nice. Wow, talk about a reduction. Down to $10, so that's just $8 for the set of, what is it? Six ruby with gold. I'm trying to see if these are flash. Oh. Even if they are, they're in very good condition. Um, you just don't wanna ever put those through the dishwasher. We do recommend hand washing. Lots of great dolls and toys and trinkets. And when this is plugged in, when we get this plugged in, he does have a black light. So this is, these would all glow here. A nice old thermometer with the baby. And these are all glowers down here as well. 
And don't forget any of the price tags that you see, please take that 20% off. I have the larger one of this at home. This is $20. It's not, this is the water mill. I have one with a little cottage on it. It's 3D art. And just be prepared if you do get this to keep gluing on the pieces because that's what I've been doing. So it's stronger and better than it's ever been. This is 19, late 60s, early 70s, 1440. Ironstone lidded dish. In nice condition. It's got these funky flowers on it. You can see there's some crazing to it, but it's usable. Very nice. That is, is that silver or green? Yeah, that's green on there. So if you had to, I, I guess, I don't know if that's microwave safe, but safe, but you won't blow up your microwave if you put it in there at least. Wow, that's, that's reduced quite a bit from eight down to four. So just 320 for this really cute little metal boot. And look, it's even got little cleats on it. I'll get this into better light, get a better shot of this. So this little metal boot is just 320. Very cute. It'd be a cute little planter. It looks like it was a match holder. So that's quite a good deal on that. He's got lots of littles down here. I, I kind of got excited about this shoe. to get this shoe. I'm kind of holding on to it because at that price, lots of jars filled with items as well. And jars with nothing in them, just collectible. I was reading today, I saw a thing pop up on my Facebook feed about uh, using jars for your strawberries and grapes and that, and you put them in the refrigerator. Do not wash them. You put them in there and they, they actually, their shelf life will be like three to, it actually increases them to about three weeks. So if you have glass jars, you can store your fruit in there. Do not wash it because apparently strawberries are very porous. So if you wash them and then put them in there, you're, you're kind of risking growth. So just put them in, wash them when you go to use them. That's a good little deal, $8. So as you can see, this is good to go. Again, we're visiting with good to go. He is 20% off, items not marked firm. He does have a mailbox. We do not get mailboxes in here very often, not this old. And that one's just 39 and then 20% off. Very cool. Tweed suitcase. Let's see. Oy. 60. There's a window. Let's see. That's a good deal. Just $12 for the chippy three pane window, which a lot of people use for their events and just to decorate with. 44 on the metal cabinet. This game does work. I, I think I've zoomed in on it before and mentioned that it was not the best laid out plan because you see all the scratches because you drag this little gun along with the more, with the metal, the magnetic beads and you end up just scratching the heck out of it. So, but it does work. You can still see in there easily. So now this little cabinet, he does have the measurements on this. So that does help us right there. It is tin. It's got the opening there. And it's a little ooh, red box. It's a little wonky, but you wouldn't be putting it anywhere but maybe standing it up like this. It does have the shelves in it, nice and deep. That is a great piece if you have an older kitchen, older home, that's beautiful, or you want the older look. And again, you are watching Gray Barn Andover visiting with Good To Go tonight, vendor code Nick. That's just $5 for that cute cookies tin. It has a little condition issues, cosmetic, but still very cool looking. He is a 20% off vendor, items not marked firm, and that is off that lowest price. So if you see a clearance price of $8, you're taking the 20% off of that, thus making that just $6.40. We are getting near the end of tonight's tour. Wow, that's really good. A dollar firm on these little cruets with the stopper. They're glass stoppers. That is, that seriously, that's just a dollar for each of those. Very good deal. Some great old tins. Swear box. Where's the, I know that had a price tag at one point. I don't see it now, but that, we'll have to look for that. And before we end the video, we will go back up and go over how to contact us. There's another suitcase. That's just 28. He does have records. He had these in the front. This is the drawer he had 
up front, and they are also 20% uh, off if they don't say firm. He's the only one with an anvil in. I, people are always looking for anvils. This is not a huge one, but it's also not a jeweler's anvil. We've had the tiny jeweler's anvils, and this one is 59 and then 20% off. So that one be easily mounted. I mean, <laughs> mounted. Uh, you can just put it on whatever surface the sucker ain't moving, but it is recommended to mount it if you have a, a workbench or whatever, and you can hammer away whatever you need to hammer away on that. Okay, the game is 49 and then 20% off. This is all one piece. I was looking at this. This is some kind of, it's sitting on a music stand. So you can see the ends, this comes up. It has these little angle things on it. And here's what it is, how to use it. And again, these are, the, these, these are on here. These are not sold separately. This is all one piece. And this is $44 for the lab equipment. A couple little horses. And there actually is a full-size spinning wheel in here. And that is 95 and then 20% off. It even has, look at this. Is this just not beautiful? If you love true antiques, you have to have a spinning wheel amongst your pieces. And look at the finish on this lamp. And that's dragon engraved, and that's 125, so that'd be 100. Oh yeah, there's the little dragon face. I see it right there. Boop. And there's another lamp next to it. This one is 65 and then 20% off, and that's marble with the onyx base. As is, it does not have the globe, so you'd have to find. I mean, you don't really have to find the globe for it. Because I mean, it would look, I mean, the bulb would not stick out that much. So you'd have this piercing with the light coming through. It would be kind of cool. And then this is the base on that one. So not easy to tip. And then another piece of lab equipment, 85, and then 20% off on that. So if you're looking to make your lab, we've got that here for you. And then the music stand is 125, and then 20% off on that. So we're going to walk on back up to the front. I'm just going to kill this light here, and we're going to get this light over here. And again, the only vendors which do not have a discount in our shop are just three vendors. The train vendor, our coin vendor, who's actually our Byram coin and jeweler guest from down the road, and then the general store, which is the candles and the candies and stuff. So we're going to just hit this. I think that I only have two lights left on this side, so I'm just going to kind of... Is this an adorable little night light? See how well that works as its flowers have chips 16. And this, I'm right now, I'm in Redreamable. But I'm going to take advantage of having the camera with me and go along and turn off some lights. This booth, October 1st, will be the third booth for our vendor, Burning Sensation. So those videos are going to be longer. As you can see, we do have a candlestick phone, a wall phone in here. It's missing one of the bells. It is as found condition, untested, 95 and then 20% off. But you do have the major components of it so you can find that bell very cool and nice vintage drawers here and they're 20 percent off yeah that's vintage crush on second thought and we are almost back up to the front so as i said the general store so that would be like this little corner pantry area with the Whitley's peanuts and all the jams and jellies that we have from Ohio and imported from Scotland and mustards and all the candies. Our coin vendor is mostly located in here and we have a couple other items from him. You know, they also have this jewelry out here, which is priced very well. A little glass kitty, he's just $3. He's got little glass whiskers. And there's a tiny pewter cat over there that's also just $3. So let's get back over to how to reach out to us. Again, we visited with Good To Go, and you are at Gray Barn in Andover, New Jersey. We're in Upper Sussex County on 206. That's 134 Main Street, which is actually Route 206. We are exit 25 off of Route 80, and then you just head north up towards Newton. We're about seven minutes off the highway. If you need items chipped, and you wish to get an idea of an estimate of how much it would cost, just use our zip code of 07821. Go to the USPS website, and you'll see a little tab on the top that says calculate a price. So you'll put in your zip code, our zip code, 
and click on package, put in a weight to guesstimate. And again, I, the next the, underneath that, make sure you click package again. And then if it's over a pound, we're always gonna use that priority mail. It's very rare that we're able to use the um, flat rates. The flat rate usually doesn't work. They're always very odd sized boxes. So um, if we can, we try to use whatever's most cost efficient for you from the post office. So without further ado, I'm just gonna kinda focus up and show you what a beautiful evening it is. And I wanna thank you for spending some time with us at Gray Barn of Andover and have a wonderful evening.